Hello everyone, it's me ASML welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you photo editing process by the help of the camera filter and the Nick collection. So let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. The previous photo was like that. I'm deleting all the stuffs. Okay, fine. And then you have to copy this one by pressing Ctrl or Command J or plus over here, drag this layer into this plus sign and after that going to the filter and camera filter if you don't have camera filter please check out my video description for the download link and this one you are getting the similar settings and the panels like lightroom and in this case i'll use the preset which i made earlier here the load settings options and going to the load settings which is the asian and just getting these type of effects let's discuss about what i have done the settings over here the temperature plus 5 and the tint minus 5 when you are getting the plus sign and you are getting the minus sign in the different levels it will help you out to make this one differentiated here the exposure 0 and contrast 0 highlights minus 49 you can make it increase if you want the photo editing is totally up to itself or himself or herself just because of your eyes will talk which one is good which one is not good and which should you stop that point okay the highlight minus 32 and the shadow minus 5 and white minus 20 and blacks plus 30 and the texture minus 3 i don't want to make this one too much uh, like uh, this i want to make it a little bit smooth that's why i made this one minus value minus 3 that's good and the clarity zero and dehaze so what is the dehaze if you make this one hazy it will be foggy and if you make this one dehaze it will give you the clear view one thing is that this photo example and your photography couldn't be same you have to edit yourself just because of adjust the settings according to your photographs here the saturation and vibrance vibrance 15 and saturation minus 33 the basic is done now going to the curves here i made the curves like that the input value 255 and output value 249 input value 189 and input value that is the 191 and out input value 128 output value 122 and input value that is 58 and output value 29 and here input and output value 2 and 0 that is good and detailing option the sharpening 0 noise reduction 12 and the noise color noise reduction that is 17 and here the color mixture uh, which is the hue saturation luminance hue green hue plus 79 and the saturation of the red minus 35 here you are getting the red like that and the orange plus 20 and the yellow minus 21 and here the green minus 91 and luminance plus 15 orange minus 5 yellow plus 15 and the uh, green minus 30 that's good and the color grading here only use the shadow color which is the uh, hue which is 36 and the saturation 3 little bit of colors and optics i didn't use geometry i didn't use any effects here minus 18 for the vignetting proscrop vignetting grain 0 and all the stuffs are uh, as it is or by default and here the calibration i didn't use the calibration over here and hit the ok button so after adding this preset you have to change it out according to your photography and after that going to the here the filter and nick collection this one is another plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link please check out my video description just because of this one is uh, giving you a bunch of presets and stuffs so here uh, the cross processing this point and this stuff and here lots of uh, sub method which one is perfect for your photography you have to define or you have to pick up from here uh, this one this one this one t01 or c04 okay and t04 which one is perfect for your photography you have to find it out and c04 and hit the ok button so this one is another uh, things which is really good to help it like uh, adding some uh, filters in your photography and it's uh, like nice here if you want you can make the fill percentage that is 85 so let's see the before one and after one so let's apply this preset to this type of another photo going to the file and open options from here 
uh, I have another types of uh, images like uh, this so taking this one okay press controller command J it will help you out to make another copy of this layer and after that going to the filter and camera filter and then here going to the load settings options and the Asian so you're getting like that so in this portion you can increase the exposure a little bit and contrast a little bit uh, shadow a little bit and let's see before and after you are getting huge change over there and after adding the preset you have to do another thing which is uh, the actually nick collection from here color effects pro and by adding this effects or color effects pro it will just provide you extraordinary image and hit the ok button it's taking time to load it up and providing you the final output which is really cool and let's see the output let's see the before one let's see before and after so saving it out in your directory at first the PSD format so this PSD format is that format PSD format you can use this one in future to edit and now going to the JPEG options and the save option save as option actually and from here you have to make this one JPEG and you have to define the different name just because of the previous name will be same and save it out and hit ok and the previous one saving this one and after saving that I will make the output so going to the save as options from here choose the format which is like that and here take different name just because of redundancy and here the options the like uh, how many size will be the photo the here progressive here optimized standard so i do like to keep this one standard and the file is larger and hit ok you're getting the jpeg form or format over there so let's see the before actually before and after so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i may say when you're signing out stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers bye bye